It's become part of the fabric of downtown Palm Springs. The Forever Maryland statue is in its last days here in the desert. She's about to be packed up and shipped back east, ending nearly two years of standing on the corner of Tokwitz and Palm Canyon Drive. Tonight, the city's hosting a farewell celebration for Marilyn, and our Angela Monroe is there. She was there when it first went up. She's there as it's coming down. Angela, good evening. Good evening, Gino. It's a day that many hoped would not arrive. People are preparing to say a final farewell to Forever Maryland. The towering 26-foot statue has stood on this corner in downtown Palm Springs since May of 2012. Tonight, there will be tributes from city and resort officials, musical performances, and even a special guest appearance by Carol Channing. And, of course, photo ops for folks who want one last shot with Marilyn. Everyone wants their picture taken with Marilyn. Countless photos snapped in the past 22 months. The Boardwine family just captured their second family photo with the towering icon. We saw her uh, two years ago in Chicago, right off of Michigan Avenue, and uh, it's very cool to see her again. We were actually quite surprised to find her again. Ironically, another Chicago resident was reunited. Marilyn and I go way back. She was in Chicago not too long ago. She's fabulous. But some residents aren't ready to say farewell. I don't like that. She belongs here. And I think a lot of people feel the same way. Businesses also soaked in the benefits of the tall, smiling blonde basking in the sun. Maryland has garnered so much publicity for the city of Palm Springs and our destination that if you put a price tag, would be millions and millions of dollars. Photographer Greg Felson has followed Forever Maryland since before she arrived and will follow her once she departs. I, I will see her once again in New Jersey, May 2nd, 3rd, and 4th. There's a retrospective of the life of the uh, sculptor who made this, this, Sewer Johnson, and I'm going there to photograph it for the foundation. But this doesn't have to be a final farewell. Negotiations are underway to buy the statue for around a million dollars and bring it back to Palm Springs. The negotiations are going on and hopefully we can come and strike a deal within the next 90 to 120 days. If a deal is struck, Maryland would return to Palm Springs and be displayed again when the new mall opens at the end of 2016. Diehard Maryland fans say she needs to return. After all, some like it hot. This was Maryland's home for a long time. I know she loved the place here. Her and Joe loved here. She was discovered here. This is Maryland's history. And uh, back in Chicago or Jersey, I don't think so. She belongs here in Palm Springs. Now, the PS Resorts chairman told me that Forever Maryland will be dismantled on April 1st, and then she'll be put on a truck and leave on April 3rd, headed towards New Jersey. But tonight, as you can tell, there's a large farewell celebration. Already many people turning up. It will begin at 6 p.m. Live in Palm Springs, I'm Angela Monroe for KMIR News. Now back to you. We do hope that they can reach a deal and keep her here. Bring her back.